Hello, my name is Pixelated Twix, and welcome to Boundless. It's actually been a while since I have given you guys a video of just me playing Boundless. I know I normally will update clips from Cosmic Mermaid stream on Twitch uh, from uh, the adventures with uh, Melanin Sims 2000, myself, and Cosmic Mermaid. Um, but today I decided that it was about time that I give you a personal up, uh, update on what I've been doing in this game. Um, if you're not familiar with Boundless, it is a, I want to say that it's close to a Minecraft MMO, but uh, on a different scale. Um, this, the graphics are a little more realistic. We're a lot more realistic, obviously. You can tell there's a huge difference. Um, and don't judge me, but I am a pack rat. See, this is the problem with these games. I'm a pack rat. I'm a pack rat in Minecraft, pack rat in World of Warcraft. I'm a pack rat in Boundless. Anything that has crafting in the title or just crafting in general, that's gonna happen. Don't judge me, but this is um, my little storage area under my house. This is my workshop. It's a work in progress. You can see that I still have some unfinished walls here. I don't know what I'm doing in here, um, but these are what you call workbenches. These are crafting tables. It's been, you guys, if you remember where I started, we started from the bottom, now we're here. Um, we're still creeping on up. Let me get this because I need this. Um, so yeah, this is where we're going. We're still working in here. Um, I do need to put some things away and I'll do that in just a moment. Actually, let's do that right now because I know I have a few things that I can put away here. Now, look, this game um, promotes pack readiness. Yes, I said pack readiness. I know that's not a real word. That's not a real thing, but uh, it is today. Um, it is today. So you're going to have to accept it. Um, but the reason being is because every single planet has its own color theme. And when I mean color theme, I mean trees, I mean trunks, dirt, clay, sand, fo foliage, um, water, <laughs> rocks, plants, even the animals match the, um, or the animals, the enemies, because they're enemies. There are no, there are no just animals. These are all enemies, but they all have their own theme. Let me show you. See, these are plants from, these are, this is foliage from different um, planets. And then we have over here, tree trunks, right? Then we have rocks that you can find on different planets. Now I've since refined these and made these smooth or what have you, some of them. Some of them are in their rough cuts. Now this isn't all, this is just me, like, you know, there's more colors. There's 255 colors in this game. I have nowhere near collected all of them, but that is my goal. This is sand and clay. This is lava here, dried up lava. Dried up lava, sol solid lava, solidified lava, ash. That's what that is. This is, um, what is this? This is gravel. Up here is mud. Um, This is marble. Over here is gleam. You guys, Gleam, let me give you a closer look. Look at that. Gleam is amazing. It's amazing. It's beautiful. It makes light like this or like this, or you can have these little blocks here. This is a raw and a cut here. This is refined right here. Um, they make doors. I will show you. Uh, oh, you can make vases with the Gleam, different colored vases. You can make stuff like this. You can make this door. That's a gleam door, plain gleam door. Then you've got a stylish one here. Yes. And uh, here's more stone that I, that we have placed down in Purple Rain. Uh, that's the name of our, of our settlement. You can do so much with gleam. It's so beautiful. This is this was my original house. I've since up since I've since I've since upgraded it. And I'm still working on it slowly, but surely. But let me show you what's going on in the basement. Uh, or this is Purple Rain's um, storage facility. That's what we're calling it. 
Um, I've been working on this slowly but surely. Yes, I have several projects going on at one time. That's what I do. I have ADD and um, I'm proud of it. Yes. So the the floor isn't finished. The ceiling is, isn't finished. I am my father's daughter. This is exactly what my father would be doing. Uh, he would have this major project and would never finish it. This is going to get finished, though. I promise you. But we have things going on here. These are things that we've all collected together. I've also been putting things in here on my little journeys across the lands, the many planets, having fun collecting colors. Yes, these are all the gifts, too, by the way. All the guys that have been helping us, when I say guys, I mean everybody. I'm from the Midwest, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, see, there we go. Um, so please don't be offended. But all the people that have been helping us, Digby, uh, Digby Caesar, Lancelot, um, Veruca Cat, everyone ha that has stopped by, Death666, um, yes, they have given us gifts and things like that. These are gifts that were given to us by Digby. Look at this. Look at this. This is for Valentine's Day. Yes. Let me show you my skin. This is from Valentine's Day. This is the back. This is the front. Those wings are from uh, Valentine's. Uh, oh, sorry. This is Cosmic Mermaid's Fence. I have to use it properly, even though it's not finished, but we're going to use it properly. So this is my house. This is, this was, this is the original. This is original. I've been working on that, but this is the new one. I think I like this one a little bit better. But I'm working. I'm doing better. And over here um, is a little gazebo that I, I built. And I had a lot of help from Veruca. He helped me yesterday before Cosmic Stream. And uh, we did a great job together. We make a pretty good team. Um, he, he has chisels. Let me show you something. This is one of the best parts of the game. Not just the colors, not just all the blocks, not all the planets. I've got to show you guys some planets too, by the way. I'm just gonna, we're just going to run through. You're going to get a full tour of the place because this game doesn't get nearly as much hype as it should. And I'm here to do just that because if you like building, if you like colors, if you like... Um, uh, if you like combat, this is the game for you. All right, so I'm just chiseling. Chisels do things like this, like I'm showing you here. Chisels also do more than that, but my ba my chiseling skills are quite basic, just like my building skills. Um, but if I will show you what chisels can really do. Um, I will show you Millen and Sims, but there's so many different places and different planets that the chisels, oh my gosh, you guys. But this is slightly a, a good idea of what chisels can do. See how this, this is gleam. This is a decorative gleam, but um, it doesn't come like that. It comes in a square. Everything comes in a square, but you can shape and mold with chisels. Um, yeah. And okay. So yes, you see that I've entered purple rain. All right, so I am still working on this place. This is Cosmic Mermaid's house. I love her house. Look what she's done with the foliage. Gorgeous. Um, this is one of um, Melly Mel's, Melanin Sims. I call her Melly Mel. One of her houses. See what she did with the chisel? See this? See this? This is our first workshop. This is... Um, you know, all other machines that you don't need to see in there. You don't, you don't need to see in there. We won't go in their houses because I, you know, I'll let them do that when they decide to do that. This is another one of Melly Mel's houses. These are her alt houses. This is her vault. You can lock things up guys. And you know, uh, we can't go in there. I can't go in there because I don't have permission. Um, this is another one of our houses. There's things called mold. This is what mold looks like in the game. Look at that color. Look at that guys. Look at that. Um, we also have company, uh, company. We have a visitor who comes by very often. His name is Veruca Cat, and he has settled here. Um, he's got this little garden. And then, check this out. The water vader, I'm still getting used to this. Okay, so give me a moment. Let me, let me get my, okay, look. See, look at this, look at this. Okay, I'm getting better, though. I'm getting better. But this is what machinery looks like and boundless these things under here are power coils 
Um, but this is the machinery compactors. There's so many things, so many machines. But this is Veruca Cat's workshop. He built it over here. Um, and he's allowed us to use it because the workshop that I was um, building was just it wasn't up to snuff and he was just nice enough to show me up <laughs> I'm kidding um, these are enemies they're called spitters this has become a tutorial I guess but whatever we'll we'll, we'll go with it um, we live on a beginning planet I want to say beginning but um, the enemies get harder as tiers go up. And when I mean tiers, there are different tier planets. There's tier one all the way up to tier six or tier seven or tier six. Somebody help me out. Is it tier seven or tier six? Either way, there are higher tiers. The higher the you up you go, the prettier the rocks are, of course, and the gleam, of course, but also the ridiculously harder the enemies uh, but this is our portal room. And in this game, you use portals to travel to through the different planets. Um, I use this portal quite often, as well as this portal here created by Digby. He did this whole area. This is a, um, this is, you know what this is. I don't have to explain. <laughs> and this is a portal -loo. This is cute. So you go on this little portal here. This takes you to a different planet. We have now entered um, Stars Hollow. This is um, one of the guilds that we are a part of, um, and we also are a part of Yilis Nation. Um, so this pretty rock is called Ort Stone. It's gorgeous. You see that? Look at the detail, you guys. Look at the detail in all the different stones. This is marble. This is white marble. It's Pretty expensive to make. Also just expensive. Um, but yes. That over there, if you can guess, if you're a fan of Stranger Things, Digby built that. You can tell me what that is. I love Stranger Things. This is also Digby's um, workshop. I won't go in there um, because, you know, it's his workshop. <gasps> this was new. Look at that. That is gorgeous. But these are things. This is what chisels can do. Okay, I don't know what that is. I you can explain that. Um, you'll find things like this. You see that up there all across the world, different planets, because people are crazy and they think that you should die um, by j going up there and jumping down or something crazy. But I have done it. We've all done it. Um, here's another um, chisel piece of work. Um, but this is just like, this is a small town. Let me just take you to another planet. We're gonna go through Tig's tunnels here in just a moment. This is a maze. We won't go in there, nope. I don't feel like getting lost, cause I will. Okay, so here we are, Tig's tunnels. And I think, um, whoa. I think um, Feminorum is the name of their guild, I think. This is, um, no, okay, I'm wine. This is called Femin Feminorum. Feminorum, am I saying it right? This is the planet. That is not Tig's. Is, um, okay, I see, I'm still learning. Forgive me. Okay, so he created a system, or he or she, don't know, created a tunnel system or a portal system where you can visit most, if not all, planets up to tier six. I think there's a T7. I don't know. I cannot visit, yeah. There is a T7. I cannot, no, that's two. What is that? That's Tana 7. That is a T2, which tier two. You, you, you got it, right? You got it. I don't need to explain. But anyways, you can visit all these planets through here. Of course, you have to have resistances and things like that to get on certain planets because they are dangerous. We are going to go, uh, let me see if I can find a really cool one. I have my favorites. Um, let's go through here. Uh, that's not the one I want to show you, but this is really pretty nonetheless. Um, there's one that I found today. Oh my goodness. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. The gleam is freaking gorgeous. Is it Bori? Which one is it? Is it Till? Is it Till? Mm. No, I think it's... Look at this. Look at this. This is Till. Look at this. 
Oh my God, got too close. Look at Till. It's snowy and beautiful and dangerous. So we're gonna go back in. It's not as dangerous as uh, that word right there, the Sarim, Sarim Pensaradini. Mm -mm, don't know how to say that word. Um, but I have been on this one and I just wanna show you, we're just gonna sneak up on some of the, the, the mobs here. But this is what I talk about, what I mean when I say each place has its own color theme. Um, actually, there aren't any um, enemies around. I'm surprised. Oh, I'm lying. I think... No, I don't hear anything. Anyways. See, this is gravel. This is rock. Okay, I'm lying. See those, those guys right there? Not nice. Not nice at all. Um, I don't have the... Um, though enough left on my sling bow. That's what I'm carrying here in my left hand. Do, whoa, okay, that noise. That was a meteor that fell. That's a road runner. They're going to run away from me. Okay, so this is not the planet I was talking about. I think I've never been here. Let's go through. Oh, okay. So I cannot go here in this planet. This is a T6. I'm not ready. I'm not big enough to ride that ride yet. But this planet, check this out. Um, I just need to be cautious. But look at this. Look at this. Um, I was on here briefly. I ha was on here long enough just to grab a couple rocks because um, those guys right here, these guys, these guys, they blow up in your face. Um, and it takes me a long time to kill them, as you can see. I think he's going to blow up. He's he's pissed. He's pissed. Look at him. He's pissed. Got him. There's another meteor that fell. Sometimes you can actually see them fall. Um, but yeah, so look at this. This is, this is ash that I'm walking on. I, this has become a tutorial tour th type thingy. But I wanted to get some of this mold, um, strong violet, strange, uh, violet. This is so pretty, so pretty. And I went to bring some home. Um, I'm not really sure what that noise is, but that can't be good. Um, this is strong or strong slate. This is a um, thorns. Yeah. Like I said, everything has a theme. Everything has a different color. Oh, let me, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I just want to get a piece. I just want to get a piece. He sees me. No, he doesn't. Okay. I just want to get a piece of this twisted trunk. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, that's really pretty. That's really pretty. Okay, let's get back to the, oh, he's in my way. He is in my way. Duck on it. Just, just die. Just die. Okay, cool. He's dead. Okay, I got him. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. So, oh, look at that. Look at that. I don't know if he's... Okay, he's, he's neutral. But look how big he is. Now, we have these same type of mobs. Just... Sort of, they're cuter, they're smaller, but they're not called mighty wild stock. They're like wild stock and stout. That thing's huge. I tried to kill one of those and he beat me to smithereens. Wasn't pretty. Wasn't pretty at all. Um, I think I think this is where we want to go. Yes. Okay. Let me show you what Gleam is. All right, so we have to be careful going through here too. Okay, I'm just looking around. This is a uh, glacier right here, but okay, see? Okay, that's just, oh, he found me. Okay, do you see, I'm sliding. Do you see the green right there sticking up? That's what we call gleam, that's gleam right there. I'm gonna see if I can kill this guy. Ah, oh, gosh, great. There's a spitter, too. Oh, oh shoot. 
I don't want to fall. Because if I fall, he's going to kill me. Oh, great. Fudge. If he blows up, I'm going to die. Oh, great. He's got an advantage, too. Good, good, gamugga. <sighs> okay, this spitter is probably gonna be a pain in the butt. Oh! He hits, I don't know what that is, he's throwing. He's throwing bombs, he's throwing bombs, he's throwing bombs. He's throwing bombs. Um, oh, die, oh, die, oh, die. You jerk. Okay, so. Here's the deal. I want some of this gleam. I also want some of this blue great glacier, but um, this is ice. That's not glacier. So I just want some of this gleam. And I'm going to get out of here. I just want a little bit. I need to watch my back, though. Yep. Okay. I, I don't know how aggressive these guys are. So I'm just going to go up here really quickly. Some of this light blue. I don't have much left on this diamond um, hammer. This is about to go. Um, okay. Okay, let me eat. Oh, he's coming up here. Crap. He is coming up here. I don't have much of my sling bow either. Can I just sneak around him? Nope. I'm going to have to go through him. Doggone it. I'm going to have to go through him. I'm going to have to go through him. This fool has bomb ba -ba bombs. He's got ba -ba bombs <laughs> just <laughs> everywhere. This is not cool. Look at this. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Is his meat blue too? Oh, okay, that sounds wrong. Um, so we're gonna slide on over here and get back. This place is cool though. This entire oh, look at the trees. Let's go. Time to go. Time to go. Time to go. Actually, it's just a spitter. I can handle him. I want to get some of those trees. See the leaves? See the trunks? Oh, he's coming right up on me. Let's just go. All right, let's just go. We're going. Okay. Anyways, I just wanted to give you guys a brief look into Boundless and what's going on. You guys, if you're really into building and you love the idea of exploration, um, um, amazing community. Oh, look, this is also gleam. Look how the gleam, the gleam grows here. I'm going to have to come get some of this. I'm just going to have to. Yes, I have to. There's no questions. I look at that. That looks like Christmas tree bulbs. Oof. Okay. Let me just plan my attack here. See, that's in water. If I can just get, is this, is this land? Is this, okay, we can clear this. We can clear this. Yeah. Okay. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? That's what gleam is at night. Look how gorgeous that is. Now there's some thorns in the way, so we're going to have to chop these down. Night is your happens to be one of my favorite colors in the game anyway, so uh, this is a bonus. Mm -hmm. And that means I'm hungry. Uh, did I pick that up? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me just be extra freaking careful because I don't know what's around here. You can usually see on the UI if there's an enemy that's close, but okay. We got everything. Okay. Let's just get the heck up out of here. Um, Normally, I would try to venture off a little bit further. Ooh, <gasps> I bet you these are protected. Oh my gosh, look at this. Let me, let me, there we go. See how pretty that is? Look at that. Nope, that's protected. Is this part protected? Nope. See what I'm saying? Look how beautiful, look how gorgeous. Look at that, and the, the grass is purple. What color is this rock? I think I have that. Look at this. Anyways, like I said, if you're into building, you're, oh look, these are some of the plants. I can't pick that up because I don't have the, um, without breaking it, but look, see, that glows in the dark. 
Isn't that gorgeous? You can pick that up if you have the um, the um, the epic speci uh, speciality. The trait. The epic trait. That's what I'm looking for. If you have the epic trait to pick that up without breaking it, you can take it home, replant it in your own garden, stuff like that. Yes. But if you're into Minecraft, um, if you're into building in general, and like I said, if you like uh, combat and exploration or just exploration in general, um, if you love hanging around and uh, being in amongst amazing people, I highly recommend you pick this game up. It's available on Steam. Not sponsored, just telling you it's a great game. That is one of the planets, um, and you can usually see these um, from your in during, at night, sometimes during the day. Um, I can't travel it because I don't have a portal epic, but yes, look at that. That is... Don't know how to pronounce that. I'm not even going to try. I've already made a fool of myself more than once today. That's it. All right, let's see what we got. We got a piece of trunk. We got this. Don't know what that's for yet. Don't know what these are for, but it's cool. Got some gleam. I'm going to put that in my little collection. Got some more thorns. That's awesome. Got some mold. going to put that in my collection. Got some pretty silk lavender exotic foliage. I'm done for the day. I just wanted to show you guys what this game was about. All right, if you enjoyed this, please let me know. If you have any more questions about Boundless, I don't know if I'm the person to ask, but I could certainly uh, try. But there are so many different people um, on the Boundless server. Uh, in Discord, you're more than welcome to join. I can link that to, um, I think, in the description box. We'll see. Um, who would be happy to uh, answer any questions you might have, or even just follow uh, at Play Boundless on Twitter. Highly recommend you doing that if you're interested. Also, there are um, plenty of people here on YouTube, uh, Javita being one, that uh, have lots of videos on Boundless. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope we just hope to see you uh, in game. All right, that being said, I have been Pixelated Twix. Until next time, ciao.